In downtown Atlanta, animal advocates gathered outside the state capitol to bring awareness to animal cruelty. So this comes just days after video of a DeKalb County man beating a dog began circulating online. Now we do want to warn you, the video of the attack is difficult for some to watch. Fox 5's Joy Dukes has more on this story. These things should never happen, and these people should not be let out of jail. In Metro Atlanta, a group of animal lovers is calling for accountability as DeKalb County Police continue their investigation into a possible animal cruelty case caught on a neighbor's doorbell camera last week. We're out here today for justice for justice. Um, the dog was brutally murdered by a very inhumane person who just got out of jail today. The video that surfaced shows a man chasing a dog and then punching it. Seconds later, the man picks the dog up by the head and throws it at a wall before chasing the dog up the stairs. It's too much for me. The suffer. I cannot stand at this kind of thing. So I heard from friends exactly what was in the video, but I'm not watching this. I cried hysterically and the only thing that I could think was how many other animals may be going through this and all of the people that should be screened before they should even be allowed to adopt or have an animal. On Friday, DeKalb County Police identified the person in the video as Makai Jackson. Jackson was arrested and charged with animal cruelty after police said the dog in that video was found dead in a wooded area not far from where the attack took place. If you can do that with an animal, you will do that if a human being. It's a matter of time. With signs and banners in hand, animal advocates stood outside the Georgia State Capitol Sunday, hoping to bring more awareness to animal abuse in the state. Our goal is to get the Atlanta task force on a bigger mission for the animals. They say they're encouraging anyone who believes they may have witnessed animal abuse to notify authorities. In Atlanta, Joy Dukes, Fox 5 News.